but USA has USA has water. USA has large tracts of land. What is going to happen to Europe? The thing is that I have to bake a cake for my friend's birthday tomorrow. The scribe, I'm the navigator. Yeah. It's like that. Yeah, that's a nice, very nice way to put it. Achha, the navigator. Achha. You won't edit this out, right? But this book is not about detachment. It is about over attachment and over indulgence. That is what it no, is. No, but I think what would happen to me is that in every place, I would want to. My first reaction would be, oh my god, I have to come back here again. In every place, she would identify a old derelict but hauntingly beautiful house that she would want us to acquire <laughs> all on a budget of 500 rupees a day. We left our jobs for one. Well that, no, that was not the heartbreaking. Okay, that was not heartbreaking, yeah. It was actually it was moving bank breaking, yeah. It was bank breaking. Okay. But moving out of this place, moving out of Delhi, that was heartbreaking. You know, other travelogues and other books on, essentially books on India, the other travelogues, are written with people setting interviews beforehand and then going and conversing with people. This book doesn't have that element at all. We were not that different from each other. No, I think we are different in, in, the, sense, in the sense that uh, sometimes I don't want to talk at all. Yeah. And he's more, you know. See, I can become surprisingly gregarious yeah. on journeys. Although usually I am, you know, lost in my thoughts. Yeah. But on these journeys, on journeys, I would talk more. So he's the one who like talk a lot on buses with people and, you know. But so alone time was really difficult on this. But but I do remember this one morning in Kajuraho. I was exhausted. And I didn't really want to go out. So I told him, you know, and he can be a bit of a maniac when it comes to, okay, so now we have to go and do the temples and it's 47 degrees and I will go to every temple and walk in. But that was a good thing. I did go to every temple. Yeah, so in the morning, so I told him that I'm not going to go. I'm going to enjoy some alone time in the hotel by myself, so you go, go. We, we changed everything about our lives to embrace this life of, be of becoming writers. And at that point, it made sense to actually move back to Calcutta and, and find our feet as writers. And it involves, you know, once you, because that was, the, our first books were then in production. It involves a lot of struggle in many ways, because yes. you're, not, you're used to, a, you know, a, an income that comes to you at Every the end month. of the month. So There's this entire setup yeah, that you so run and then suddenly all that goes away and so then you have so to the move. anxiety of that in marriage I think after the journey it was easier you know because one is of course we had got married when we were very young so we didn't really understand marriage we just left it to it and then we were finding things out and then you know we gave the impression to people that we were settling down and growing up and then we threw that in the air again and when we did this journey so I think we've been bad householders together for a long time. And are we worse householders now? Yeah, so I think now the illusions <laughs> about each other have gone. So we do know each other better. And now now you say what you were saying. Yeah, as far as our relationship is concerned, it's certainly stronger than it was then. But as far as being householders, I think it is more difficult now. Because we are now as in, you know, in motion in our heads. We're not, we are not really, it's difficult for us to stay put. This moment in the book when you know we are in Barmer in the desert on a dune, and our auto wala who had taken us there on the dune says that why don't you come to my house for dinner? And I say of course we'll come. And he said you know I don't know this guy, you know, and I'm thinking you know I think it's fine. So you know so that's where the impulse is. Yeah, but I didn't say that we won't go at all. I just took a few precautions and then we went. Yeah, I know. So that's what I'm saying. So my gift to you would basically be to not make you feel guilty. Yeah, your gift is restraint. The gift of restraint. That. Okay. Well. Nothing of that old, nothing of that old stuff is here right now. Oh, okay. Nothing. Absolutely wow. nothing. Now I'm trying wow. to think if there's All that stuff is in a play, is in a one of our places No, let me try to, no, at least, I'm sure at least a few of the books. You are here, right? You are here. No, no, I'm sure at least a few of the books have, have done the whole... Thing in Kapdan. You will a circuitous journey why can't yes. like nothing. Absolutely. I am nothing. going to actually fish out a book that must be. No, you fish out any book and say that ah, That's not true. Kalkata. It's not gonna be any book. Nothing of that old bunch is back. Well here, this except the two of us. No, okay. no, this book. This book definitely 
is one thing. I bought it in home bookshop. Hey, right this here. one doesn't come. Whatever. <laughs>